This is a curious thing because PMA, the case of the Darwin Dormitorio, is not really a fraternity hazing. It's uh, the whole institution, the PMA, uh, involved because uh, it, apparently it's part of the quote-unquote training to be a soldier. And we have heard uh, off the record remarks that the reason why they allow these things, hazing, uh, to happen in an institution like the PMA and even in uh, police training academies is because they're training them to be strong against physical pain and physical torture of enemies in a war. So they're strengthening them as future soldiers or cops. Uh, but in your case, in fraternities, I mean, you're talking here about future lawyers, future doctors, um, future, future leaders. leaders. And there's no need for physical pain tolerance. It's there. So why do you think that culture was embedded to begin with? I, at least in my case, uh, actually, I'm not really in favor of hazing. But when I was there, of course, I, I wanted to join. And I had to undergo the hazing. But if there was anything na nakuha ko naman doon was... After that, sabi ko, ba kaya ko na palang gawin lahat? And parang naging, ang tapang ko na, na parang naging sturdy ako. But parang, what kind of parang, hazing did they do to yeah, you? Yeah, it was, of course, it was also the same. May paddle. May paddle din kahit babae? Yes, yes, oh. yes. Marami mo sa yung mga ganun. Most of all, mga sororities at fraternities, tumaan yung mga, yung lahat ng mga legs, ang ano, nang, nang, nangingiti. So, namagamaga yeah, yes, ka rin? Yes, ka rin. And oh. of course, yung mga... I cannot say, kasi... <laughs> but as somebody no, who but went through that, po, yes. do you... Meron ho kayo nahugot from that, or do you think it's still necessary no, at no, this no, point? No, 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 no. Kasi marami no, But you were saying that it made you stronger. Yeah, it, at that time, kasi sa akin yung experience ko, sabi ko parang ang galing... Ang tapang ko na it made me stronger, oh. na parang gust, kaya ko nang harapin lahat. But of course, there are other ways mm -hmm. para tumapang ang isang tao. Mm -hmm. So, I was very young then. Eh ngayon, eh... Hindi naman kailangan gawin yun para tumapang isang tao o para maging karapat dapat maging member ng isang organization. Some would say na the, the forging of the bond in fire is what uh, what really strengthens. strengthens the bond. That's what some would say. Mm -hmm. uh, in fact, that's I think that's also the argument for some people in the PMA. And mm -hmm. as well, some people who join elite military units uh, may, may ganun ding perception. I, I wonder po if that is something that, uh, that you have seen in the last uh, so many uh -huh. years. Alam mo, may, actually, I will have to be frank. Siyempre, may resistance. Special kasi, uh, especially sa mga age namin na uh, who underwent sa mga ganyang rigors. Ano, ayaw. Kaya, look, look, ayaw, pa, na, ayaw, ayaw sana na panggalin. Oo, oo, kasi nga, parang iniisip nila, di ba, na mm. you are less of a brand parang if you did not undergo hilaw, yes, parang no. ganyan. But, of course, hindi na pwede. That's why you have to accept it.